The following piece is called Be Consumed. There's no time for hors d'oeuvres, no time for plating. You're my last table and I've kept you waiting. I arrive naked with just a lid on me. I lift it and say, I hope somebody's hungry. I work a knife into the meat, all the way around I twist, until I've carved a bacon strip right out of my wrist. Now lean back, open wide, say ah, as I unspool my forearm into your gaping maw. When I've stripped my hand right down to the gore, you bop up in your seat, a puppy yapping for more. So I move on to the other arm and carve off bits of bicep, strength I never put to use, a grip on things I never kept. I feed you the parts that I can afford to lose, but you keep yapping and I just can't refuse. So it's onto the vital organs. It's onto the things I'd rather not share. Still, you've got an appetite and I pride myself on being a good waiter. I open my skull and give the best service I can the best years of my life, all my best laid plans. By the time I've scooped my brain out and fed it to you like bits of popcorn, I don't know any better than to give my last beating organ. Take the napkin from your lap. Dab the corner of your lip. Don't bother opening your wallet. Don't bother factoring a tip. This meal is on me. Or it was me, I guess. You live to consume. I live to impress. <laughs>